We're officially on to week two of the college football season and the Montana Grizzlies now look forward to a trip to Grand Forks, North Dakota, where they'll be taking on the Fighting Hawks inside the Alaris Center for the first time since 2018. North Dakota is coming off a 21-3 loss at the hands of Iowa State, but don't let the loss fool you. North Dakota is expected to be one of the top programs in the FCS this season, and that stems from a rushing game that posted 170 yards in Ames on Saturday. The Hawks have the same two running backs from last season, and, that's, and that split the carries, and that's behind an offensive line that 11-year head coach Bubba Schwager typically gets the most out of physically. They have good running backs. Um... They are persistent with the run game. They've got a pretty expansive scheme in terms of different run plays they can get to. Um, their offensive line's good. And, you know, I, I think that, uh, you know, it was, it was kind of fun watching them play against Iowa State because they, they, uh, they held up really well physically. And a team with a good rushing attack might be the perfect test for this Montana Grizzlies defense with a number of new faces in the starting lineup. That's not to say the new guys haven't made an impact. Transfers D.N. Andres Lehrman tallied a sack, while fellow transfers Vi Cajo and Pat Hayden both made multiple tackles for loss. The talent flashed a number of times on Saturday night, but Montana safety Ryder Meyer, who's the team's returning leading tackler from last year, spoke about how the consistency needs to improve sooner rather than later. We're a team that prides ourselves on tackling. Um, our coaches emphasize tackling, practice it every day. Um, there were definitely times where we lacked uh, in our tackling, and that's going to be improved and something that we continue working on moving forward.